a more full body shot. I'm gonna start getting ready for dinner. So I'm gonna try to run eight miles today. So where we last left off, I am Kelsey, so happy to have you here. I'm gonna be doing a weekly vlog, so come along with me, it's just a week at home, nothing too crazy. Uh, my husband, Brian, is out of town, and so, yeah, it's just me and Rye. Rye, come here. Come here. This is Ryder. So, the two of us are gonna be hanging out all week. So let's see what we get up to. I don't think it's gonna be anything too wild, but just excited for a chill week at home. Please subscribe. Wanna see you around for next week's vlog and all the vlogs after that. And leave me a comment. I'd love to hear what you wanna see. We have some fun travel coming up later this year and exciting things, but do you also like the chill stuff? Just let me know. So this is the Kite Hill Plain Yogurt, almonds yogurt. Mango, frozen blueberries, have half a banana, and then this really yummy new granola that I've been trying. It has really low sugar, which is nice, and vegan. I try to do as much vegan, or just like non-dairy stuff as possible, and then added hemp seeds and extra uh, unsweetened shredded coconut. It is like 12.15, I'm just making some lunch. Making a little panini press situation. This is a sourdough rosemary bread that is always so good. We have the bacon that I cooked this morning and then did a little bit of chicken salad essentially with some avocado mayo. Have the um, vegan kale pesto from Trader Joe's. The shoe holder for my closet. I worked on cleaning out my closet this weekend. And I want to organize a bunch of shoes on the back of my closet wall. I'll show you later once we go upstairs. Cool. Yeah, just a little canvas storage bag. I thought the canvas looked a little bit cuter than they had just like the clear plastic ones. So I'm hoping this looks a little bit better. Cool. All right, we are in my closet. Um, I got the stuff to hang this from Amazon, like I mentioned earlier. So let's see if it works out. Closes. Alright, let's fill it up. out pretty good. A few more pairs of slippers, so I'll stick those there and then still have space for a few more. This is the rest of my shoes. So we have boots up there. 
I went through this last weekend to organize and clean out a little bit and then have more here. So this is nice. I've um, had to keep stuff in like bins before for my slides so it's nice that I can have all of the shoes visible which I think makes it a lot easier to see and put together outfits and everything. So this is great. Love it. If you can't tell I'm a big neutral shoe gal. It just makes it a lot easier and things go with almost every outfit. Tuesday. Another day. I'm actually heading into the office today. So poor little Rai Rai is going to be home alone. We have a rover coming. We. I. <laughs> I have a rover coming. But yeah, heading into the office. It's 6.54. I couldn't sleep last night so I got up at like 5 and then nodded off until about 5.30. So showered. Got ready, folded laundry, went for a walk with Rye. Now I'm just hanging before um, going to work. I go to the shuttle, um, so I should probably leave in about 30 minutes, so I can just hang out until then. But yeah, last night just watched some TV, hung out, and just chilling. At home alone life, you know, it's so rare. But let's go cuddle with Rye. All right, let's check the Insta. Posted a cute pic yesterday. I went to the Seattle International Film Festival opening last Thursday and it was really fun. So yeah, wanted to post that. I did a kind of more full body shot a few days before. Very New York feels, but in Seattle, which is really fun. So, let go. Good morning. Do you want to go for a walk? Wednesday. I didn't vlog a lot yesterday. I came home, I went into the office, and then I came home and was exhausted. So, just hung out. Um, today, I'm working from home. I have a lot of meetings, especially in the morning, and then some this afternoon. So, it will be semi-busy, and then I have therapy, and then after that, I'm going over to my neighbor's house. Um, my friend Melina's for dinner, so that should be fun. I I'm wearing this cute striped shirt from Mango. I got it for our honeymoon. Wedding and honeymoon, so that was fun. He had fun running around the beach like he always does. We had some good cuddle time this morning. I was not feeling a workout, so it did not work out, but I'm hoping to squeeze that in later. Coffee time. Feeling iced this morning, so I'm gonna do an iced almond milk, latte and then I do little vanilla pops like 
Du sa da. But we are going over to my neighbor's house for dinner. We're ordering from Cactus, which is a really great little Mexican spot. And then we're both Bravo fans, so we might watch a little bit of Bravo. But she has a mini golden doodle that writer is obsessed with named Rainy, so we'll hopefully be able to have them play a little bit. But I think that's the plan the rest of the night. It's Friday, it's been a day or two. It is 5.45. I just went for a three mile run, prepping for my half marathon. I do one or two kind of shorter runs each week and then I try to do one long run every weekend um, and continue to build mileage for that long one. So it's after work and so I'm going to get ready in a little bit. I'm meeting some girls at 7.30 for some drinks and Mexican food which will be really fun. Getting ready for that and then my cousin Devin is going to spend the night since Brian's gone. It's fun to have something to do, someone to hang out with. So we can hang out with little Rai Rai. And then tomorrow we're going to meet up with uh, my sister-in-law, Lindsay, uh, also to hang out with Rai. Everyone just wants to hang out with Ryder too, which is really fun. So yeah, hopefully we can get up to a little bit of shenanigans and have a good time. Hey. We're just hanging out with the El Charo last night, which is fun. Fun. Just did a quick body shower. I'm gonna start getting ready for dinner. Nothing too fancy, but let's get ready. So this is some of my favorite foundation. It's the Dior Backstage. Next, I'm doing my NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer. This is in Vanilla. my girlfriends this weekend. Um, it's always really fun to see them. I have a few girls who are really close to where I live and so we always hang out and it's good to get the group together. Next I'm going to do my Clinique Chubby Stick. This is in One Curvy Contour. I'm gonna go in with my trusty Hula Bronzer. And then I'm going to go in with my Westman Atelier uh, blush in Couchette. This is a newer find and a newer brand for me, but I've really been loving it. Next, I'm going to go in with a little bit of highlight. This is the Laura Mercier highlight in shade 1. the matte radiant faint powder. It's really beautiful. It's really shiny. Sorry, and I think the fan was on the whole time, so I'm sorry if that was really annoying. Do a little bit up there. Next for brows, we are gonna do my trusty combo for the Benefit Goof Proof and Anastasia uh, Clear Brow Gel. What else we got? I think just eyes and lips. I'm just gonna do an easy wing uh, liner and then do a little bit of mascara and I'm out of my favorite mascara which is also the Benefit one. Um, so I only have this Neutrogena uh, waterproof one which is great for if you're going like swimming or something but it's not my favorite for just for every day just because it's really hard to get off. Um, but let's go ahead and do some lashes. I've talked about this on my Instagram before, uh, which is Kelsey this year. If you don't follow me, definitely go check it out. Uh, but this is the Chanel Rouge Duo, which has a gloss, which I like. 
Um, and then this is the shade Darling Pink, but it's really beautiful. And yeah, I love this. So you do this end first, and then this end will be the gloss. So let's get it going. I let it dry a little bit, which I think helps make it a lot more long wear. And then in a little bit, I'm gonna go back in and do the gloss sign. Let's go ahead and do my hair. So I'm gonna start with some dry shampoo. And this is my absolute favorite. It's the Amika Perk Up Shampoo. It smells so good. Little Ryder's back. Hi, Ryder. All right, I got changed. And then as an undershirt, I have this really cute basic that I just got from Aritzia. I just got one in black too, and I'll link everything down below. Everything that I mentioned throughout kind of all my videos will be linked down below. And then this is a cute button down from Anthropology. So this is really cute. It's green, it's kind of a seafoam green, and I've loved doing a little bit of more layering especially with spring, it's still pretty chilly here in Seattle, so it's fun to be able to layer. All right, got my trusty way texturizing spray. So I'm gonna do a little fr front tuck sitch, and then these are really cute black um, pants with a little slit in them. These are from Zara. Oh, hey. Um, just wanted to show you kind of final look before I head out. Uh, this is a JW Pay um, little bag. It's kind of like a Bottega dupe. It's really cute. And then this is a really cute oversized trench that I just got from Gap. Not oh, getting close to it yet. Oh, this wait. Is hefty. Wait, 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 w
Um, I was definitely getting a little bit fatigued at the end, but that was because I hadn't eaten before. And so, do not recommend that. So I'm gonna eat and then wait about 30 minutes or so um, to let myself digest a little bit, and then I'm gonna hit the road. So, let's eat breakfast. Bon appetit. I just finished up my run. Good preview. Did it eight miles today. It was at a pretty good pace. So let's go get Ryan and hang out at the beach since it's such a nice day. Back from my run. It was really good. Ran a good pace. Now it's time for some lunch. And I'm also sipping on this pressed green juice. It's the Greens 1.5 with cucumber, celery, lemon, spinach, kale, parsley, and sea salt. It's really good. It's super nice out, so I'm going to eat and then go up on the roof and read a little bit. All right, zucchini is all chopped. Time for baby broccoli. Some of our other goodies. All right, these are my two seasonings, the umami and the green goddess from TJ's. I've added some olive oil. I'm going to stir these. So I'm going to start cooking these with the mushrooms and the kale first since those take longer. And then I'm going to add in the tomatoes, chicken, and the pre-cooked quinoa at the very end. Right, all done. Have some extra cooked veggies, so I'm gonna store that and use that for like breakfast scrambles and different things. And then this is with the chicken and quinoa, and I added avocado and some hot sauce. I also made an iced coffee with coconut milk today. Hello. So where we last left off, I was having lunch. I wanted to just say thank you for being here, watching this video. Please give it a thumbs up, subscribe so you can see me next time. I'm gonna start trying to do weekly vlogs. So please check that out. And then all of the links for anything I've talked about will be uh, in the description box below. So see you next time and thanks for being here.